all right people my name is Dennis as you can see I, I just built this database and it looks so cool and I'm here doing nothing and I just decided to go over with you with this database and show you more about this database as you can see uh, it just says right here cash payments report um uh, it's an accounting um uh, method that we use to uh disperse or uh, just make payments you know just to keep track of your um cash payments you know so it's a tracking method and it, it works so cool i have this is the report right here i have as i have to report this one and that one and this one the account numbers one 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 and over here the account number is one 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 zero and um people who have steady accountant knows what I'm talking about pretty much but it's not really you know it's not of a big deal I can explain it to you right here this account number you see right here comes from this table known as the chart of account so I'm keeping track of uh, my the things that I need to keep track of so I assign number to cash one 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 zero so if I see here on my report that one 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 zero, then I know it's cash. I could have um, omitted this number and put the cash right here because I have cash right here, it's already right here, and I put that amount right here instead of putting it right here. And so I can use different methods to collect this or to report on this same information. I can take two steps. Let's see, I can say maybe uh, I'll put uh, the 250 right here under the cash and take here zero zero and I will save this now let's close or and open the report now we don't have the account number but we have the 250 in the cash credit column which is the same if we had the 1110 here and pull the two hundred and fifty dollars credit right here. So um, this is how the database works pretty much. I can also input something right here, and it's gonna report or choose uh, this date, and maybe I'll choose this account number. What is this account payable? Uh, probably. And maybe I'll put the debit right here. Five sixty nine. As you can see, if it's an account payable, it's account payable debit. And if uh, let me see the chart of account. Two is not payable. Therefore. Is since it's the payable and this is a debit, therefore I'll put debit here and put the account number right here. It works the same, so I'll save this and close. Or let's look at our report, it's gonna be the last one down, and we have it here account number the dates on um, the refer 
um and blah 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 we don't have a vendor let's go in here and let's Uh, close. Save. Now we don't have zero zero. Save. Yes. Mm. Let's format this a little bit. I've seen something. Go to the home. Save this. Now it's pretty much aligned. Um, this one too. Um, Um, and this how it works guys there was not not nothing really much about it all I just have was a uh, burn this table which is this one as you can see I can go in here just more and just input right here for just more if I wanna if is I'm paying some cash to him I can just go here so as for Lasco I can just go up here so close this up form and I had this chart of account which have my account number account name and account account class let's look here this is the um, design view. I just use number short text, short text, and there comes the big part, the last part, which okay, which you can see the data type dates. This is uh, the account number and the vendor. The vendor is a uh, lookup value, which is this two tables right here and finally let me close on yes the report is based on this table this report right here is based on this table and it's so simple and neat you know I can print it out have it just like this design it looks so pretty and guys this how it works thanks for watching and if you need this file 
send me an email or a message I will email this file to you it's up thank you